This year, the Mead ladies made history in winning their first ever Senior All-Ireland Championship. It was probably one of the most exciting matches I've ever been to, and it really shows that hard work and determination can pay off. Girls, you are an inspiration. You are role models, not just to young girls in the county of Meath, but all over the country. And I cannot wait to see what you do next. Good luck to Eamon, to all of the team and to everyone involved. Hi guys, this is Andy McIntyre here. Uh, I'm just sending you a short message to thank you uh, for providing us with what was undoubtedly the sporting highlight of the year. And the performance that day uh, against Dublin and Croke Park will live with me and with a lot of Mead people in particular uh, for the rest of their lives. I also feel uh, it it would possibly prove to be inspirational, probably not just to Mead people, but to other other teams and other codes. That's that's how far reaching your uh, your performance has been. Anyway, congratulations once again and thank you very much. Have a great night. You guys deserve it. Cheers. Hi girls, I'd just like to add my congratulations to everyone else, to Eamon, to you all and to the management team, to Colm and all in the county board on your fantastic success this past summer. Um, it's very rare that I get to walk down Jonas's Road in a Mead jersey and support uh, the county team and it's a long time since I felt that buzz and excitement in the stand and the tension uh, in the last few moments and it was a wonderful occasion inside in Crow Park and a day that's going to live long in my memory as I very rarely get to um, celebrate successes uh, on the football field. And I'm thrilled for you girls just to congratulate you once again and wish you all the best uh, in the coming years. Hi everyone, you're not looking at Rory's stories, it's Gary Rogers here. Um, just want to say a huge congratulations and well done to everyone involved in the Mead Ladies football team. You had an absolutely terrific year last year. I think without question it was definitely the game of the season, no doubt about it. Um, I watched it. I watched it here with my girls. We put up a mead flag. We got from Jaxie Kearns that day, and um, we're very proud um, of the performance and the team. I think you know you should all be very proud of what you achieved last year. It was incredible um, performance, and um, to do it on the big day in Crow Park, to go and beat an unbelievable Dublin team as well, and you now to be able to say that you're all Ireland champions. So, con huge congratulations, and uh, hopefully you can kick on and, and repeat it again next year. And um, so, very best of luck to everyone. Enjoy your night. Hey girls, it's uh, Rory here. Listen, I uh, just want to congratulate you again on the unbelievable achievement last year of winning the All-Ireland. Yeah, listen, genuinely was one of the best days uh, I've had in Crow Park ever. Especially beating the Dubs, you know, it doesn't come uh, too often nowadays, but you've done it in, in just spectacular fashion. And I suppose my little daughter, Ella, who was there at the match, only eight years of age uh, last year, and just fell in love with football. Um, and you know, ask what does it take to to uh you know play in Crow Park, etc. And just obviously training and, and belief and work hard, and that's what all you all you uh, just is. Just you know, I remember that time in in Ashburn when you had lost your your second All Ireland final in a row, and and I just got a vibe off is that there was more to come. And but sure, who would ever thought that you could go on within a couple of years and and win the senior All Ireland? So listen. Nothing stopping is going on winning back to back as he's now the talent is there, it just comes down to hard work and I've no doubt uh, that's in steel which is all the time. So listen, congratulations again and looking forward to seeing you in the future. Up the Rylers. Hi everyone, Rachel Blackmore here. Just coming on to send a quick message to everyone on the Mead Ladies football team. I want to say a massive well done for what an incredible season you had last year. Topped off in Crow Park with an incredible performance, such determination and grit. It was really class to watch. So massive well done. I'm rooting for you again this year. Uh, so the very best of luck with the season ahead. Hi to everybody on the Mead Ladies and your management team. A fitting reward for your great year, having a civic reception. You were an inspiration to everybody during very dark times over the last couple of years, breaking the dominance of Dublin and uh, Cork, and of course you did it with style and grace and composure. Everywhere I go, people speak of the Mead ladies, and you are an inspiration to every man, woman, and child in the county. And maybe if I have one request for you for 2022, could you please just go and do it all again? I'm Gavin Jennings, presenter of Morning Ireland on RTE Radio, and for over 40 years, a proud supporter of Meath football. In recent years, with the help of my daughter and top footballer, 
Lucy, we've seen good days and bad days. Living in Dublin as a Mead supporter isn't easy, but on the biggest day of them all, it was wonderful. To the finest football team in the country, thank you. Gavin Jennings, RTE News, Navan.